Our next story is about Tesla. Last week, Elon Musk called off his trip to India, citing what he called heavy obligations at Tesla. Reactions and speculation followed. Some critics said that he was just staying back for his pay package, the $56 billion that he wants shareholders to agree to. He's staying back to secure that. But turns out there is more to this decision. Tesla is in trouble, and by extension, so is Elon Musk. The company will release its earnings tomorrow for the first three months of 2024, and shareholders are preparing for the worst. Reports say Tesla could show its worst financial performance in seven years, and the signs are all there. Sales are down, profit margins are declining, and Tesla is struggle, struggling to deal with the competition. So we don't really need to wait for tomorrow to understand what is plaguing Tesla. Buyers are not getting their deliveries. The company has pushed back multiple delivery dates. Sales have dropped by almost 10%. In response, Tesla is now selling cars at a discount. Last week, they slashed prices worldwide. In the United States, at least three Tesla models saw a price drop. They've also cut down their workforce. Earlier this month, around 14,000 people, 14,000 Tesla employees were asked to go. These are all warning signs that no investor can miss. And three of them stand out. Tesla is selling fewer cars. It is failing to meet delivery deadlines. And it is reducing profit margins to push more cars out of showrooms. What does this mean for Tesla? Its fortunes are declining. And this is showing on the stock price as well. In 2024 so far, so far in this year, Tesla's stock price has dropped by a whopping 40%, 4-0, a 40% drop. In 2021, the company was worth over $1 trillion. Do you know what the value is today from $1 trillion? Today, it's a little over $450 billion. So in three years, Tesla has lost half its value, over $500 billion lost. It has slipped behind Boeing on the S&P 500 index. This is a stock market index. It features America's top 500 companies. And Tesla's losses here are worse than Boeing's. And that's saying something. Boeing has lost the faith of investors, with jets and parts falling from the skies. Tesla apparently is doing even worse. So what is Elon Musk's plan? How will he turn things around? He's switching gears and changing directions, taking even bigger risks. Elon Musk is making another big bet, this time on robo-taxis. It's a new form of self-driving cars, not driven by humans, but machines. Musk wants Tesla to make robo-taxis. In fact, he wants to launch one as soon as August this year, which is barely four months away. It's a steep deadline, especially when Tesla is falling behind on deliveries. Can it launch a new product category altogether in less than four months? More fundamentally, does Tesla even have a prototype? Do they have a working robo-taxi? Uh, robo Do they have a model today? They don't. So far, Tesla has not submitted any designs or working models for a regulatory approval. There are other companies who have tried to bring autonomous vehicles before Tesla, and all of them have failed miserably. In 2018, Uber was testing out its own robo-taxis in Arizona. They had to be banned. Do you know why? Because Uber's self-driving car ended up killing a pedestrian. Just this year, Google's driverless car hit a cyclist. Thankfully, he suffered just minor injuries. Now, these incidents highlight the biggest challenge for autonomous cars. The technology is hard to crack. Can Tesla do what others have failed to? Does Musk have an ace up his sleeve? His investors are skeptical. They wanted Tesla to produce a cheaper car instead, something that masses, the masses can afford. And apparently Musk did try. He ordered his engineers to make a $25,000 Tesla, but reports say the project will now have to take a back seat because Musk is prioritizing the robo-taxi. It's a big gamble. If he succeeds, it will be a revival of Tesla. If he fails, the consequences will be disastrous.